My name is Hans Christian Tungesvik. I'm 27 years old and a professional triathlete from Norway. I'm here in Alcudia in beautiful Mallorca uh, on a training camp now in, uh, in September. Uh, I'm preparing for, uh, for my last race of the season, Ironman uh, Florida in uh, November and I'm really enjoying the, the training days. Life on training camp is quite easy. We get up in the morning, have a, have a morning coffee to, to get, the, get the body going, maybe stretch a little bit and jump in the water. Normally we do half an hour to an hour uh, morning swim. Head back, uh, proper breakfast before jumping onto the bike. The run is also uh, really nice here. You have lots of flat, uh, flat road sections uh, here, and so it's easy to get quite some some mileage done. Uh, so the volume, the training volume, becomes quite high when I'm on a training camp here. Then we go out for a bike ride. Everything between two to six hours, depending on if it's a hard, hard or an easy day. Uh, mostly we take advantage of the, of the mountains uh, down here. There are so many beautiful uh, climbs and also descents on this island. So we, when we have the possibility, we really, really uh, take advantage of that. Um, normally when we're done with the, with the bike ride, we do some kind of off-bike off, uh, off brick uh, run. Uh, half an hour to an hour, uh, often in race pace or close to race pace. Then it's um, getting home, getting some dinner in, uh, recovering and uh, just relaxing before, before a new day of uh, more or less the same. Of course it's a lot of hard work with uh, 25 to 30 hours a week of uh, quality training but we are, we are really enjoying ourselves out here with this weather, fantastic nature and good company with, uh, with uh, co-triathletes uh, under the same uh, coach. So uh, I feel really, really privileged and lucky to, to be able to enjoy this lifestyle now, now for some years and enjoy the life as a pro triathlete. My big goal this year was uh, the Norseman Extreme Triathlon. This year it was also a part of the inaugural World Championships in Extreme Triathlon, uh, which made it a bit more interesting actually than, uh, than just a normal Norseman. Yeah. I, be, I had been dreaming of this race for many, many years. Uh, even before I started triathlon, I wanted to do a Norseman. Uh, and after having done it a couple of times already, this year was really the time to step it up and, and go for a podium, podium placement. On the bike, I just felt incredibly strong, uh, stronger than I've ever been on, uh, on a bike leg before. Uh, I was actually able to, to get away from the, from the front pack and went solo for 150k, uh, crossing the mountain plateau in Norway. So I, uh, I came into T2 with, uh, with a three-minute lead. I knew the chasers, especially uh, Alan Hovda, the pre-race favorite, was a good runner. And I expect him, expected him to, to overtake me, and he did, after 15 kilometers. So then I have to, had to make a choice. Do I want to follow him, or do I keep my own pace? And and hope and believe that uh, I'm going to take him from Zumbi Hill and up to the finish line. He got a two minute lead and we uh, kept that distance for, for uh, quite some time. I thought that I had to uh, settle for second place, but uh, 500 meters before the finish line, I actually saw him for the first time. The feeling and sensation of, of just First, uh, catching uh, catching my eye on uh, on the leader, 
the rush of adrenaline and uh, pure will uh, flowing through the body uh, and the body just running away without even thinking of it. Catching, catching the leader uh, 100 meters before the finish line uh, and taking on those last few steps knowing that shit, this is actually going to happen. I'm going to win, uh, win Norseman, one of my big, big dreams. And uh, climbing those last steps towards the finish line, meeting my family on top uh, and just collapsing uh, down on the, on the rock stairs was just an incredible feeling something I, I will never forget and, uh, and uh, yeah, I can't, I, I have trouble just describing it still uh, a couple of months after, so uh, incredible. Yeah, the first, uh, first goal uh, now after Norseman is uh, Ironman uh, Florida, 2nd of November. Uh, it's a really fast course and I will try to, uh, try to take down the, the Norwegian fastest Ironman time, uh, which is currently 8.19. Uh, it should be possible on a good day, uh, so that's what uh, motivates me right now. For next season and also the year after that, the big, big dream is to, to qualify for Kona as a, as a pro, uh, pro triathlete. No Norwegian has ever competed in the pro category in uh, Kona before, so it's really about time that, uh, that some of us get there and uh, I don't see any reason why that shouldn't be me. So. I'm in it to fulfill my potential and have lots of fun along the way.